everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. I hope you're doing absolutely fantastic today. I have a couple of surprises. They're gonna be on a couple of different videos. I'm so excited to share it with you. So with that, let's get the video started. <laughs> Okay, let's get started. First off, the bag of the day that I am carrying right now is none other than my Speedy Bee Mon Monogram. I've enjoyed carrying her this weekend. Got her very full. Still plenty of room left in there. <laughs> and then here's the thing that I've been dying to share. Look at this. It is the holiday edition bag, and I'm so excited to have her. Here are the straps on the bag itself. Truly, this one is so beautiful. I do wish this was exactly what the bags look like all year round, but this particular bag, if you find yourself in Vuitton and you find yourself getting something at this time of year, this bag is a keeper. That's one that if I were to uh, sell a Louis Vuitton bag, I have bags that I would ship with them, but this one is definitely a keeper. This one will not leave. I love my favorite all-time Louis Vuitton bag right there. So, let's do this. We've got the receipt in here. I have moved to a new CA. I'm really happy about the change. Nothing horrible to, to, to say about the shift, the, the switching of the CAs other than uh, this, this particular CA was a, a, a better match, I think, for me and uh, what I was trying to do. So that was really it. Okay, love this, love the tie. I'm gonna slide it right off. You know, I always slide it off and I think that I'm gonna put it back on the box when I'm done, but then I never do. So I don't know why I worry so bad about uh, sliding it off, but I do, but I do. All right, here we go. This has a front and a snap enclosure. Mm -hmm. Me get her out. Oh, and so just so you know, you can see definitely she's a little bit smaller. Now, before I really share this, I want to tell you I have been feeling the need for a new Vuitton bag. I have been looking online, I've spent some time in the store. I have a list of bags, as you guys know. That's on my wish list, and I usually have it numbered. This bag went extremely quickly to the front of the list, and others that I thought I would be getting sooner went down. And I will tell you that this bag actually beat out the Saint Placide, which is, I think I did it a, oh, that's maybe three or four videos ago. I went in and went, what? And I took some pictures and I, I chatted about it, so this bag, so what could it possibly be? I was so focused on that bag. And then I started looking at this bag and went, oh gosh, I think it's got like everything I'm really looking for. So here we go. Let's go ahead and get her out. Okay, okay. Here we go. Oh my gosh, she's fighting. Okay, are you ready? I'm so excited to share her with you. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. We have little feet. We have Magnolia. I'm so excited to share her. I'm looking for the tag here so I can share the number information with you. Maybe it's on, maybe it's on the bag. I'll take a look there. Uh, the name is Bond Street. Oh, there it is, there it is. N as in Nancy, 64417. 
Bond Street. This is the Magnolia strip. I love this leather tag. I, I really fell in love with this tag because this is the only one that I know. There could be others. This is the only one that I know that actually has the leather color in the tag itself. She is beautiful. Has the top handle on this side. You have that dark chocolatey brown, and it says, uh, let's see, uh, the Louis Vuitton Paris. But on this side, you have the Magnolia. Really lovely. Very lightweight bag. Let's go ahead and get some measurements on her. So we're looking at 11 by 8 by 11 by 8 by 4, a little over 4, maybe 4 and a half. Quite a substantial size bag, actually, and that's what uh, made this bag win over the St. Placide, is that, I mean, basically it held a little bit more, and believe it or not, I kind of fluctuate between the large bags and the small bags, and I thought, well, the St. Placide really kind of locks you into kind of an evening look. Very limited pieces in the bag. This definitely can hold most of my bags and can become, not most of my bags, it can hold most of my SLGs and can really become an everyday kind of bag. Let's open her up. As you can tell, it's just a pull up. Ooh, I like it. So let's do this. Look at this. So beautiful. And then if we look on the inside, we'll see the strap. Now I do like the strap. It's the it's, uh, same thing, that beautiful oh, accent colors. It's just gorgeous. And then on this side up here, you have a zippered area. Pretty ample, I'm thinking. I know I'll definitely be able to put maybe a wallet or maybe my phone. I should have filmed this on my iPad, I'm thinking. Two large pockets here. Now, these pockets are really sturdy. They are not flimsy at all. I'm trying to get you a little closer look in there. Can you see it okay? Really a good amount of room in there. Now, the one thing that I was worried about when I went into the Baton store, this has the top handle and it has the straps. It does not have like loops on the side for these straps. The straps lock up here and it's not like the Elma. It's just a basic round ring. There's your handle and then it's expected that your strap will go there as well. I was very nervous until I actually saw this in the store itself. So you can flip this back. I thought this would kind of stick up. This is very flexible to kind of fall right down. And we're just going to take this and we're going to clip it right there. And then we're going to take this other side and we're going to clip this piece right here. And no issues at all. When that handle falls down, nothing's going to be damaged, period. It's going to be great. I'd like to give you some mod shots. I, wanna, I don't want to go too far over on this video, so let's move this chair out of the way. Here we go. So, carrying it like this would look like this. And then on this, from the side. <laughs> and then with the strap, let's do this just a little bit. Actually, let me do it this way, I think. There we go. I will also add a couple of shots from the store to be helpful. This is a great bag. I'm so excited. It's very, very light. That is one of the things that I love about Baton. They're very, very light. And there you have it. Thank you so much for coming and spending some time with me. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, already take a moment to subscribe, and I will chat again with you very soon. Bye.